Hey guys, welcome back. It's a girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Thank you for subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing everything that you guys do. Never goes unnoticed. We are really, really grateful. So thank you. Hope you're doing alright and may he stay blessed. Please motivate me by giving me stuff to react to. Just give me the name or the link. Drop it down below in the comment section below and I'll check it out. Find us on Facebook and Instagram as Funny and Jesse. Say hi there. Become friends with us. We'll say hi back. Our second YouTube channel, Funny and Jesse 2.0. Head there, subscribe, and enjoy the content that we put out. So today, I'm actually going to be reacting to Quran's answer to Sad Guru. He mocked the afterlife. Uh, seems like it's going to be a very, very interesting video. Can't wait to see what it's all about. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. So when you die, depending on your culture, we will either bury you or burn you or cut you and throw you to the birds. So one thing is very clear, you will put your body back into the earth and it's a very eco-friendly thing to do. So you left your body and went to heaven. So uh, what is in heaven? In Hindu heaven, food is very good. If you are a foodie, you must go to Hindu heaven. If you go to another kind of heaven, white gowned ladies will float around in the clouds. If you like that kind of ambience, you go there. But you went there without the body. What do you do with good food and virgins, I'm asking? Hello? You don't have a body? These are all bodily problems, isn't it? لا أقسم بيوم القيامة ولا أقسم بالنفس اللوامة أيحسب الإنسان أن لن نجمع عظاما بلا قادرين على أن نسوي بنانة بل يريد الإنسان ليفعل يسأل أيان يوم القيامة فإذا برق البصر وخسف القمر وجمع الشمس والقمر يقول الإنسان يومئذ أين المفر كلا لا وزر إلى ربك يومئذ المستقر ينبأ الإنسان يومئذ بما قدم وأخر بل الإنسان على نفسه بصيرة ولو ألقى معاذيره لا تحرك به لسانك لتعجل به إن علينا جمعه قرآنا فإذا قرأناه فاتبع قرآنا ثم إن علينا بيانا كلا بل تحبون العاجلة وتذعون الآخرة وجوه يومئذ ناظرة إلى ربها ناظرة ووجوه يومئذ باسرة تظن أن يفعل بها فاقرة كلا إذا بلغت التراقي وقيل من راق وظن أن والتفت الساق بالساق إلى ربك يومئذ المساق فلا صدق ولا صلى ولكن كذب وتولى ثم ذهب إلى أهله يتمطى 
أولى لك فأولى ثم أولى لك فأولى أيحسب الإنسان أن يترك سدى ألم يكن طفة فخلق فسوى فجعل منه الزوجين الذكر والأنثى أليس ذلك بقادر أليس ذلك بقادر على أن يحيي الموتى Um, I mean, people have freedom of speech, so if someone decides to speak against another religion, the best you can do is just listen, you know. And would I call this mocking? I don't know. Many people crack jokes to lighten the mood of their audience, but I'm trying to figure out what this was. Um, Many people believe many things. I believe one thing that happens after death. You believe another thing. Another person is thinking something else happens after death. Some people think as soon as they die, they go to heaven. Others think the spirit just roams earth. Others think the spirit is stuck in the graveyard. There's so many, many, many uh, stories out there, you know, that around us that we hear that we take part in you know um of course your body dies your soul goes to wherever it goes to but then and since the body is here and your spirit is elsewhere how then do you enjoy maybe the food in the hindu heaven if you're as good as a ghost because the spirit is nothing physical you know as good as a ghost how do you enjoy that food in that particular heaven or anything else um that's what i'm saying anyone can say anything how you take it is up to you if you feel offended that's one thing but then how do you explain uh what happens after death because you are alive i am alive others will argue to say the bible says this the quran says this and um I love how this video actually responds the title is too much but I love how the video responds with um, a verse instead of someone responding because I feel like if someone responded they would have been harsh I love how the video explains God's plan according to the Quran what hap what's going to happen he's going to call you and put you back reassemble your body again you know and that's very very interesting to know otherwise what do you guys believe do you believe you're going to be given a new body do you believe we're just going to be in spirit form do you believe these earthly bodies will never see daylight again after death what are your thoughts on that exactly your opinions are always welcome if you want to explain more concerning what this video was about feel free um please motivate me by giving me stuff to react to always always suggest the name down below or give me the link and i'll be sure to check it out make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it to the friends and of course do not forget to subscribe guys and i'll see you in my next reaction video